Now, we've arrived at this point here because back in 2011, September, a medical student was late to a lecture. This was not unusual, as those of you who know her would tes testify. She had to sneak in through the back door, but as luck would have it, the gentleman she sat next to was Zaid. Apparently, they got talking rather than paying attention in the lecture, and Zaid managed to get in the fact that he had a submarine in the opening exchanges, and he took her number. Playing it cool, Zaid sent her a text. He waited till December. I think he'd waited a bit too long because her first reaction was, who's Zaid? The penny dropped when she saw him later with their mutual friend Davis, and the three met for dinner, where Zaid was one and a half hours late. An interrogation at Henley Regatta followed, and they got engaged in Saudi. My children respond to Zaid and Hiam so, so well. Children know. They can see that they both have beautiful hearts and souls. Look around you today, Zaid and Hiam. Take a look at all the precious people here today who love you and know that you will have all our support and love throughout what I know will be a long and happy life. I take you to be my partner for life. I promise above all else to live in truth with you and to communicate fully and fearlessly. I give you my hand and heart as a sanctuary of warmth and peace and pledge my love, devotion, faith and honor as I join my life to yours. Family and friends who traveled from all over the world uh, to share with our happiness. Uh, it's, it's a happy day uh, for us, Julie and I, and uh, to have uh, another daughter, which we love and treasure. And we thank her parents for giving us this extra daughter. Uh, uh, I want to uh, thank all of you who came from all over the world uh, to be with us in this fantastic day. Although she is my sister, Hiam is one of the most caring people I know. Being the eldest sibling, she has always taken care of all of us, literally, sometimes even including my mom and dad. When I was in school, Hiam used to help me complete all my homework, and on those lazy days when I chose not to do it, she would literally do my homework and place it in my backpack so that I make sure I have submitted it. I usually got an A on it. <laughs> that is the type of person Hiam is. She ensures that everyone she loves and cares for are all doing the right thing and succeeding. I am sure this is a trait that would stay with her for the many years she has ahead of her, inshallah. Before meeting Hiam, I could not imagine what true love was. However, the day I met Hiam, that all changed. We've shared some wonderful moments together, and she's been there for me through the highs and lows of the past eight years. Hiam, you're an incredible person, and I love you. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand and raise your glasses to my wife, Hiam.